Here's our topic, predicting the units of the solution to a basic quantitative problem. So again, we're not doing actual calculations here, but we're going to predict what the units of the student's answer will be given this setup. So we have 1.15 moles times this conversion factor, 1 milliliter, 10 to the minus 3 liters, all divided by 8.7 moles per liter. So we need to determine which units are going to cancel in these calculations and what the units of the answer will be. So let's look at what's on top first. I have moles and here I have milliliters per liter. Will any of these units cancel? There's nothing for moles to cancel with here in the numerator, nor are there any other uh, milliliters or liters, so nothing can cancel in the numerator. Let's look in the denominator. I have moles per liter. When I divide by a fraction, the fraction comes up and is flipped. So up here, dividing by a fraction is essentially multiplying by the inverse of that fraction. So what will happen is I can imagine that I have liters per moles up top here. And so when I divide it by this number and the units are moles per liter, I'm looking at this as a fraction, then that means that in the numerator, liters will cancel and moles will also cancel because moles is on the bottom here. Moles is, in this case, is over one. Liters was up top here and uh, in the denominator up here. So the units of my final answer, because moles cancels, liters cancels, will be milliliters.